It's 4 o'clock breaking right now. Four people have been executed in southwest Philadelphia. Their bodies all found at a home under renovation. And now investigators are looking for the shooter or shooters responsible for a crime being called absolutely evil. It is Monday afternoon. I'm Brian Taft. And I'm Shari Williams. The big story on Action News is the shooting that left two men and two women dead in a Philadelphia basement. Their bodies were all found shortly after noon today in the 5100 block of Malcolm Street. Let's head out to Action News to Sarah Bloomquist, who is live near the scene. And Sarah, this is still a very active investigation. That's for sure. The crime scene unit here on the scene doing their work behind me here in the 5100 block of Malcolm Street. They've been here a few hours now and likely will work into the evening hours. We can only imagine just how horrific this crime scene must be. Four young people, two men and two women, all believed to be in their 30s found in the basement. It does appear they were executed. So many questions now, including who would have done this and why. This is an absolutely evil thing to do. Police commanders, including the commissioner, rushed to the scene here on the 5100 block of Malcolm in southwest Philadelphia upon receiving word of the horrific discovery in the basement of this home on the block. Four people, two men and two women, all believed to be in their 30s, dead in the basement. All appeared to have suffered at least one gunshot wound. The four deceased, definitely suspicious. I got two black females, two black males. Sadly, all four of these individuals were executed. There's no ifs, hands, or buts about it. The call came in shortly after noon from a relative who summoned police to check on the safety of the people who live here. Officers then discovered the bodies in the basement of the home that was under renovation. In fact, last night around 10 or 11, a neighbor heard about four bangs and assumed it was work underway. It was likely the fatal gunshots. The house is not in disarray or anything like that. It doesn't look like there was a struggle upstairs. It just um, looks like they were either taken down there or they were already down there for some reason and they were shot. Doesn't appear to be a struggle. The neighborhood is rapidly gentrifying and the block considered safe. This level of violence stunned neighbors and even the commissioner who went into the home to see the crime scene for himself. I'm really surprised to come home and to hear this, that um, someone actually was shot execution style. Four people. Four people? I'm a little perturbed. It's an atrocity that so many people had to die at the hand of a bullet. I can't get my mind around the fact that you have people walking around capable of such vicious acts. The commissioner clearly rattled here today. Police do have tentative IDs on at least two of the victims. They believe at least one of the men lived here, possibly with the other, who may be his cousin. They're unsure of their relationship to the two women who were found here today. Investigators are now interviewing witnesses and family members to try to determine a motive. Live in southwest Philadelphia, I'm Sarah Bloomquist, Channel 6 Action News.